check one, two. So if you wanted to know if we were hot, we are. We're gonna drop it in a manner that is such like. John Gower Octet, huh? You took the whole lead with your name. You just figured that might be the right way to go. Not the tribe is coming for you. All right, there were options. That's really nice, isn't it? What's up, everybody? It's Goldie. What's the uh, what's the style of music? Where are we headed tonight? What are you giving us? Well, we're going to take you on a saga. And uh, this first tune is kind of a fusion-y one in the vein of uh, Mike Stern, Brecker Brothers, Snarky Puppy, Pick Your Poison, any of those great jazz fusion artists, Chick Corea, if you're into that. This one's called Jouet, parentheses, the title is in French. All right, we're going to let you guys have the house then. Then let's take it away. John Gower Octet, make some comments. Let's go.
so much. This next one I like to uh, imagine is the crossover event of the century. Eat your heart out, Marvel. Um, imagine if Australian R&B slash soul band Hiatus Coyote did a collab with classic jazz group Art Blakey and the Jazz Mes Messengers. That's kind of what I envisioned for this one. This is called Gravitas. Thank you. 
Excellent. Thank you so much. Good. Yeah. No, thank you. The uh, honor is ours, as a matter of fact. Uh, this is amazing. So, Johnny, like, give it to me. Where's the inspiration come from? When did it start? Like, did your mom, uh, you know, she was like, it's either the spoon or the trombone. No, uh, my parents were super cool with the whole music thing, actually. I mean, uh, <clears throat> I had a really, really cool music teacher in middle school who kind of lit the spark for me. Uh, Mr. Roberts, if you're watching this at any point, uh, tip of the hat to you. Um, benefited a lot from the great music education that we have in public schools in this country. So uh, Mr. Roberts from middle school, Mr. Patton from high school, um, Jim Robertson, my first lesson teacher, rest in peace. Uh, you're all awesome. Big thanks to you. That's a big part of where the inspiration comes from. Uh, but yeah, I mean, I, I uh, you know grew up doing public school band, played some tuba, played some euphonium, uh, took some guitar lessons played bass in a mediocre uh, punk rock band in high school, too. Um, we were called Almost Handsome. It was kind of fun. We weren't very good. Um, <laughs> and yeah, I mean, uh, decided to major in music in college, got told, uh, hey, these degree programs are too intense for you to play every single instrument. You got to kind of narrow it down. Kind of went, all right, trombone it is. Um, and yeah, I mean, uh, did a lot of writing music when I was a kid, kind of fell off the wagon from it for a few years, but uh, started writing a few years ago. Got these, uh, this fine group of people together, recorded an EP last year, um, Silver and Red. It's on all, all streaming services um, under my name. Um, but yeah, all of these uh, fantastic musicians are willing to get up here and play my ridiculous music. So uh, hats off to all of them. Um, cool if I take a moment and introduce the band? Please do. All right. Um, over here on the tenor saxophone to my right, Jake Saran. Applause, welcome. Encouraged, but not required. Playing uh, alto sax and soprano sax tonight, Jeremy Wendelin. On the trumpet, Tony Zader. On the keyboard, Sonia Walker. On the guitar, Ben Parrish. Um, on the drums, Gabe Gravano. Last and least, just kidding, Van Powell on the bass. Van and, all, Van and I also play in a group called Vanimal Kingdom Get Together, which is the project where we do all of Van's music. Um, so it's uh, the octet for my tunes, Vanimal Kingdom for Van's. Uh, so we, we, we get way too much of each other. We don't fight too much, thankfully. Um, all right, this next tune has a little bit of a story behind it. Uh, it's kind of one of those unwritten rules of music that uh, if, you write, if you're writing tunes, you eventually got to write one for your significant other. Most people go with a ballad. Um, for my significant other, I went with a pop funk tune. Uh, this is kind of a whole bunch of uh, inside jokes between the two of us, all G-rated, thankfully. A um, whole bunch of inside jokes and a whole bunch of tunes that we both love uh, smashed together into one tune. Um, she makes me happy and she makes me laugh, so this is uh, just a goofy, happy tune. This is called Boppin' Somebody. Thank you. 
Where are we headed? Yeah, so uh, this one I always introduce as our um, homage to all of the great jam bands out there. Um, I think it's uh, it's a law in Colorado that you, you have to cover some jam band tune or another if you're putting on a live show. Uh, first law of physics in this in this state. Um, this one, uh, Im- imagine Umphreys McGee with horns. It's kind of what I was going for with this one. This is called Zone Out.
Yeah. Let's keep it going. All right. This next one, uh, I'm going to yak for a second because our, uh, our, our our high saxophone player needs to switch horns and mic placement because uh, he has uh, he has the melody on this whole tune. And I wrote a sacrilegiously difficult melody for him and the guitar and the piano to play in unison because I have no self-control. Um, so this one, uh, this next tune is called Limbic Cascade. Um, this one was very much inspired and influenced by the late, great Wayne Shorter, um, who left us uh, about 10 days ago, nine or 10 days ago. Um, for those of you who uh, are out of the loop, Wayne Shorter was one of the all-time greats of the jazz community, great saxophone player, great composer. Um, lived a, all, we should all raise a beverage. Back here, yep. everyone in the uh, kitchen, to Wayne Shorter, is To Wayne right? Shorter, that's correct. All right, to Wayne, here we go. To Wayne. Um, he lived a very long, very full, very successful life, um, and was putting out fantastic music all the way to the end. Um, I think just about every jazz musician in the past 70 years has been influenced by Wayne in some capacity, so this tune in many ways is my tip of the hat to him. Limbic Cascade.
All right, thanks for coming on a journey with us. Yeah, unreal, one, man. One more Thank tip of you. that. Thank you. One more tip of that to Wayne Shorter, everybody. To Wayne. Yeah, Wayne. All right, let's keep it going. What do you say? All right. Hey, uh, part of the deal for setting up this live stream was that uh, the condition was Goldie wanted uh, wanted us to uh, get him some extra subscribers, um, and uh, the agreement was that he would uh, shoot at this live stream for us. So I just want to take a moment and uh, thank everybody who took the second to do the click. Um, everybody who subscribed, subscri subscribed to this, um, taking the one moment and making that click on YouTube was how we got this set up. So I'm going to read off a list of names. Oh, uh, nice. Of course, we have everybody in the band who subscribed. Wink, wink, nudge, nudge, I hope. Uh, <laughs> uh, what others? Ethan Barker, Ryan Kilgro, Rick Romano, John Lee, Alex Randolph, Pete Lewis, Mike Danforth, Kevin Stewart, Brett Keating, Janice Baugh, Bernie Cardell, Andy Sievers, Joe Hoffman, Max Moore, Sar Schnittman, Jack Hoxima, Tommy Vandenberg, Ellie Dunlap, Eric Richards, Eli Dougal, Nick Simons, Jake Hirschman, Ben Markley, Gino Hernandez, Dave Cormier, Eileen Sullivan, Danny Sullivan, Kathy Sullivan, Julie Ryan Silva, Marcy Gower, Jack Gower, Jana Dorfman, Jordan Williams, Francine Gratan, Daniel Wilson, Carl Lundgren, Chris Bodie, Shane Reeder, Eric Wallace, Elizabeth Twazon, Nicole Austin, David Walls, Greta Robeson, Davy Shano, Emmett Orr, Phil Griffin, Patrick Myron, and Tyler Steffes. And if I forgot anybody, you can slap me on the wrist for that. But hopefully, some, hopefully at least a few of you are watching at home. Um, it would it'd be, a, be a little weird if you subscribed and then didn't watch the stream. Just kidding. Um, They're all here. We're into 500 and now six people. All right, 506. Um, that's, uh, wow. I, I, hey, we, we always say the benchmark for jazz is if you can get more people in the audience than on stage, you won. Um, if you can fight the audience, that's a bad sign. Um, I don't think we could fight off 506 people between the eight of us. So, yeah, th thank you, audience, for outnumbering us. That's, uh, that, that's, that's a big deal in the jazz yeah, world. We're cheersing back here. <laughs> All right, I'm going to once more go around and introduce everybody in the band. Um, let's, let's start with the order of the solos we had on that last tune. Sony Walker on the piano. Jake Surratt on the tenor sax. Gabe Gravano on the drums. Also, tip of the hat to Van Powell. Uh, do, doing those uh, long, modal, walkie bass tunes uh, for, for as long as they are. I mean, that's, that, that, that's a tall order for any bass player. And uh, RIP Van's hands. Uh, but yeah, Van, Van, Van's the man for not getting carpal tunnel playing the, that last tune. Um, important job, holding down the fort. Um, I'll quit yakking. Ben Parrish on the guitar. And uh, playing all those uh, crazy lead lines on the last tune on the on the soprano sax, Jeremy Wendelin. <laughs> playing a bunch of that crazy high stuff, Tony Zader on the trumpet. My name is John Gower. This is the John Gower Octet. We've got one more tune for you tonight. Um, this one encouraged but not required audience participation. I realize that if you're at home, uh, that, that doesn't actually work for audience participation. We do this one live, it works a little better. Those of you in the house, you can join in for audience participation on this one. Um, you'll pick up on it. Here, let me help you with the microphone because oh, sure. I want that on. For okay, this. Yeah, cool, I'm cool, gonna, cool. I'm going to be your mic stand. All right. This tune's about Twitter.
<laughs> yeah, friends. Yeah, wow. Wow. Wow, and thank you. Thank you for a fine night of music. You guys are, uh, you done? <sighs> Who's got the mic? Damn it, you know? Oh, it's right in front of you. It's on the, uh, it's on the uh, table right there. Yeah, my bad. I got it really excited when we were doing the whole thing. That's right. <sighs> you guys want to go for like two, three more hours? Like, not a, not a problem? What, what, what time is it anyway? Uh, it's 12.30 now with the daylight savings. Oh, nice. <laughs> and, 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 and that makes it 148 in Baltimore, right? Yeah, yeah. Hey, uh, we've got, we've got uh, Scoop. Uh, Scoop's in the house tonight. Scoop is the, um, he's the uh, engineer for uh, the radio station thing. What do they call that? iHeartRadio. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, sick. He's, he's here tonight. Say hi to Scoop. Hi, Scoop. He'll be responsible for one day if your song ever plays on the radio. He's the there guy. You. He's the guy. Um, Rob slides in here. He is jocking. He's, he's obviously a sound guy because he's like a little bit positive and mostly grumpy. Mm. He's like, I love what I'm hearing, but damn it, there's some sound issues. It's not an issue. It's just that you're going to pick it apart until you die. It's a feature, not a yeah. bug, right? <laughs> no, it's cool. No, Rob Slide's cool. Um, and because why? Because anytime, if anyone ever says we have a sound issue, which we don't, uh, we all take shots. So Key, uh, nice. Keenan out of Salt Lake City incited that. And so shots have been taken. Uh, so Rob Slide, Keenan, thanks for being here. Sean Nelson, who's Sean Nelson? Oh, dude, Sean, he's one of my old college buddies. Dude, he's still old, and he's still your buddy, and he's in that chat room. Hey, Sean, thanks, yeah. for, th 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 thanks, thanks for tuning in, buddy. Uh, always loved playing music with you, and uh, I, I, I know you're killing it out on the East Coast, and uh, miss you. I hope you see each other in person again one of these decades. It's going to happen. Yeah. It's going to oh, happen. Boy. It's going to happen because of this live stream right here. This oh, boy. Is, we're bringing people together via YouTube. Awesome. Um, any any last words? Are there, uh, you know, what, what, what should we know? <laughs> uh, one more time, one more hand for this great band. Uh, yeah, yo. Also, uh, I, I, I got to point out Tony, Jeremy, and Gabe. Uh, this is their first time playing this set of music. Um, our, our regulars couldn't make the dates for what we've got going on this month. So these three stepped in and learned this music from scratch uh, about two weeks ago. So um, extra big round of applause for them. Nice. Tony Zader on the trumpet. Jeremy Wendelin on the alto and soprano. Piano saxophones, Jake Saran on the tenor sax, Sonia Walker on the piano, Gabe Gravano on the drums, Van Powell on the bass, Ben Parrish on the guitar. My name's John Gower. Hope you all have a fantastic night. Thanks for tuning in. That is the word, ladies and gentlemen. And as far as YouTube goes, you know how the thing goes. If I don't say please like and subscribe to my particular feed, they will cancel me as well. So please like and subscribe. That's the word, ladies and gentlemen. Thanks for being here tonight. John Gower Octet. The crew behind me, we are out.